Down U.S. State Route 395, as you approach the vast expanse of the Mojave Desert, sits the High Desert Mavericks Heritage Field, one of the most isolated ballparks in the California League, as well as minor league baseball as a whole. It sits in the city of Adelanto, a town of just over 30,000 people, in the midst of a declared fiscal crisis and a poverty rate nearly three times the national average. There is only one high school in town, but four prison and detention facilities. It is against this backdrop rumors of relocation have dogged the High Desert Mavericks franchise for nearly a decade. A planned move to Chico in the late 2000s was aborted after a state Supreme Court ruling eliminated redevelopment agencies needed to construct a new stadium. Earlier this year, word began to spread about a possible relocation to the Carolina League, the second such time rumors have gained traction in the past decade. The High Desert story took a dramatic turn this spring when the Atalanta City Council attempted to void the franchise's lease with the city and evict them from the stadium. It is the 10th straight year they have ranked in the bottom three in the league in attendance despite numerous upgrades to the stadium, unable to overcome their isolated location. Right now, the desert stadium surrounded by boarded up buildings, detention facilities, and big rigs on the two-lane road remains one of minor league baseball's biggest question marks.